Hello everybody, so in this video you're going to learn how to download and install shaders for the Minecraft version 1.21.4. Take it away! So the first thing you're going to want to do is go over to your browser. You're going to want to full screen that as you're going to be doing a lot of work inside of the browser. So, step one to getting, sh getting shaders is uh, typing into your search bar iris shaders. You'll see the top result, irisshaders.dev. You just click on that. There's a lot of reading you can do about the features and what it does, and its parity with Optifine, its socials. It doesn't really matter for us. We're just going to click on the blue download button. Now you just click download universal jar, and it will be downloaded. So, the next thing you're going to want to do is get some actual shaders because the only thing that iris shaders does is it allows for you to get shaders but you actually need shaders to use iris shaders so let's get some shaders so we're going to be doing this by going to the modern website and uh, if you go over here and click on discover content or just hover over it, it you don't actually need to click it's the same result either way uh, all you need to do is go over to shaders and then you'll see a bunch of different shaders right up here I'm just gonna choose something at random BSL and uh, what we're gonna do here is just click on versions and I am going to click on this one that was published five hours ago so now that I have BSL and iris installer we are free to close the browser we no longer need it now we're gonna go over to our file explorer so now that we are in our file explorer we just click on downloads or whichever folder you have designated as your downloads folder which receives all the downloads from your browser so here we're just gonna click we're just gonna select the iris installer dot jar we're gonna select it. Uh, if you don't have an icon here, then that means you don't have Java. So you need to get Java. You just type in Java for Windows or whichever operating system you use. Download, and you will be able to download Java. So here, uh, what you're gonna want to do is select the Java Iris Installer jar, and you're gonna want to click Open. Once you click Open, it will start up this screen so you just select your game version i'm going to select 1.21.4 and my installation type will be iris plus fabric if you choose iris only you will also need to get fabric so we just click the install button and we wait for it to finish installing and it is finished installing now we can just delete it as we no longer need the installer itself and we can close our file explorer for now so what we're gonna do here is just to click over here and go over to our minecraft launcher and we just wait for it to load up and now you can see the armadillo running and boom it is now downloaded so what we're gonna want to do is go over to installations and go over to this fabric loader 1.21.4 installation and click on this folder icon you can do this for any version as they all use the dot minecraft folder as the root folder that they all lead to but i'm just going to do it here for the tutorial so here you will see your entire dot minecraft folder i have some more stuff that you probably wouldn't have like ffmpeg or flashback but we don't really care about that here so what you want to do here is just click on the shader packs folder oh. so what you're going to want to do here is just click on the shader packs folder as you can see this folder is empty now you go over to downloads you just click there you'll see your bsl uh, all you need to do is select this and uh, right click it and go down to cut 
you'll see it becomes faded. Now you can press your back arrow, which will take you right back to your shader packs folder. Now you can right click again, and you can press paste. And now you have your BSL or whichever shader you want it uh, you went with. You have it here. And you also no longer have it in your downloads folder. That's what cut does. Now you are free to close your file explorer as you no longer need it. And you can just go over to the play tab here and press on the large green play button. Once you are in the game, you will see Minecraft 1.21.4 slash fabric and uh, this modded distinction, which shows that it is a modded instance of the game. So what you're going to want to do here is just go over to multiplayer or single player. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to go over to my sodium world. And uh, once it loads, we will be able to see the actual game. There we go. But as you can see, this is just regular Minecraft. Nothing's changed. Well, that's because we haven't turned on the shader pack yet. So just click escape and go over to options. Then out of all of these options, you want to go over to video settings. Then over here, you'll have this shader packs dot 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 section. You're just going to want to click that and you just click on the shader pack that you have. This is also another way to get to the shader pack folder and you click apply and it will turn on the shaders. As you can see, Minecraft now looks very different. If you look around, Minecraft now looks really, really realistic. The reflections look amazing. The sun also looks amazing. It's it's a really good shader pack. So yeah, that's how to get shaders on Minecraft 1.21.4. Uh, don't forget to turn on notifications, hit that like button, subscribe, of course, and uh, bye!